It's a nice red. Oh yeah! Woo! This is McFly Angler. <laughs> Whoa! Yeah! And it starts now. Well, hey, McFly subscribers. So I am down in Corpus. Excuse the helicopter back here. Super loud. Hopefully you can hear me well. So I'm down with Johnny, we, he's getting ready, I'm all set. We're gonna be catching redfish. After that last trip where we found that really good spot with all the reds, I had to head back down here and try that spot again. We've got a long walk ahead of us. Hopefully we catch this time. Johnny did last time really nice red. I hooked into a nice one, but stupid fly bent. So let's see how it goes. All right guys, so we are trying to find a spot to get through. There's a there's a spot that we saw that we can get out there and we don't have to walk as far. And that way we have the truck with us and the water in the truck. It's a little easier to fish, but there's a lot of deep ruts. Let me turn this camera around. I'm just filming with my phone right now. I don't have my GoPro out. You can see here, these are fine, but these deep ruts, it's super muddy. I don't even know where this water came from. Johnny's checking to see if he can even make it with his truck. He's got enough lift, I think, to get through this, but it's a heavy truck and he doesn't want to sink into the mud and get stuck. So we're testing it, seeing before we decide to drive through this. But if we can make it past there, this goes all the way back around to the spot that we were fishing before and we can park close, which would be nice. So we decided it's probably not a, best, a good bet because this is right at the entrance of it and it's like this. We could go through all this and get out there and we might not be able to make it any further. It would be pointless. So we're gonna go back to that spot and walk up, um, which is fine. It's just hot and it's a long walk in waders, but is what it is, so. I'm fishing with my eight weight, my Risen Goliath rod. It's an awesome rod and their whale reel. They actually recently just came out with a new color. I've got it from my 10 weight and I, it looks great. It matches the rod. It's, it's really cool looking. It's just a great all around rod. I love the handle. This thing is super tacky. Even with like slime on your hands from fish, it just, you hold it, you know, pretty well. We're making that long walk, but my gosh, we're getting swarmed by mosquitoes. They are everywhere right now. It is nuts. Everywhere. Ow. Everybody know? Yeah, I just got bit. Like 30 on you. I know. They are everywhere. I did put off on. Oh, that is bad, guys. Lots of mosquitoes. Lots and lots. Ooh. Man, I feel like I'm going through the Amazon jungle here. <sighs> oh, God, yep. So now we got to exert ourselves to kind of almost run from them. from them, get out there. I'm not complaining. I'm enjoying my, my trip, but <sighs> now that we're out of that tall grass, it seems a little better. Hopefully. We went right back in. I know. So we go to those flats over there? Yeah, maybe. So we made it out here, but mosquitoes are bad. Should we try here for a little while until before we head out to those flats? Oh, these mosquitoes are terrible, guys. Yeah, we uh, put on so much mosquito repellent. It almost doesn't matter. If you guys have been watching, 
you remember that Johnny got a nice little rat red here a couple months ago. God, these mosquitoes. Did you? Good one? Yeah. I'm telling you, these mosquitoes are... I got another hit. Did you? They're not as bad for me right now. Not as bad, but they're here. They are. God, these mosquitoes hurt. The current is moving out pretty quick right now. Ooh. Yeah, I think it's like a little perch. There was action there, but we couldn't tell if it was bait fish. We got a couple little bites and nothing, but we're walking through to these flats area where we were the last time and hooked into some nice reds. So that's what we're hoping coming through here. Beautiful, beautiful water. I think it's a little higher than it was before because this was all dry. So that might be good, might be bad. We're not sure. Yeah, it is. Johnny found a red. There's a couple of them right here. They're coming our way. Yep. Yep. Right there. Come on, Johnny. Get picked up. Are they coming? They're going after it, I think. Slow it down. They're coming your way, like right towards you. Ugh. They're everywhere, man. Why haven't we hooked them? So I threw on a new pattern I kind of came up with. It's got a little foam in it, so it sinks super slow. Now I want to let you all know, we were planning on keeping any legal red. I don't usually keep trout or freshwater fish, but I do like eating from the salt water. But we do so sparingly, only enough for a day of barbecue. We're not looking to fill our freezers. Come on, red. Oof. Yeah, ah! Oh. I had one. He bit. Let's see, what happened here? Nothing? Nope. I did a trout set. Well guys, it works. It just, I didn't keep them on. My own fault. I trout set that stupid thing. I didn't do the correct set. So my own fault. Is that red right in front of you or mullet moving? Wonder why the rat reds don't even bite. You would think that they, you'd think the rat reds would bite. No, I'd like something. All right, guys, hooked up to a red. Maybe. Woo.
Yeah, guys. Woo! Finally a red. He doesn't seem huge, not like the one that you caught, but he might be legal. No, probably not. Hey, you got those uh, grabbers? Uh-oh. Might have side hooked him, man. I mean, I, he bit it. All right. Got myself a red, guys. Woo. No, I didn't side hook him. He's in the mouth. Let me get those uh, grabbers. Huh? What? I don't know. This time, I hooked him. Yeah, he's a keeper. Nice. He might be right under. Check him out. Oh, he's a keeper. I don't know. That's yeah. like, that's close, man. That's right at it. I got to let him go. Yeah. I'm not going to chance that. It's pretty on there, man. He's on there. He's right. He's right at it. Yeah. Hey, wait. So what is the, what is the amount? Hold, can you hold that? I've got in my bag an actual measuring tape. Make sure he doesn't die in case we have to release him. That doesn't. Here. 19. Mm. Dang it. All right. There you go. Now wiggle his tail. All right, guys, there goes that red. Well, I got one, one inch shy. At least I know this fly works. Here you go, I already hooked one. I'm excited, man. Finally, finally, finally caught a red and that's on this fly, guys. I'm gonna definitely tie it up for you guys. Yeah, there, it's deep and it's kind of muddy. Yep. It's not as clear as last time. Right in front of you, there's one, right there. Uh, right, uh, a little further. There's a couple reds over here now. Oh my goodness, this wind is getting bad. It's really tough to see the fish. And this is kind of mostly sight casting around here. It's so wide and open, but I can kind of make out some silhouettes every once in a while. Here's one right towards me. You don't see that? Oh, come on. You're right there, Dean. Not see my fly. Oh yeah! Woo! So the red started running towards me, and I tried to run backwards, but my boots were stuck in the sandy bottom and down I went. <sighs> Whoa, I tripped. Whoa, guys. I don't know how I still have them on there after tripping like that. Trying to run backwards. I think this one's legal. Oh, 
Bring him up to Johnny. It's a nice red. Well worth falling in the water. Hopefully I didn't soak my batteries. I feel bad still having them here, but at least I'm keeping them in the water, doing my best here. I don't have the grabbers for them. And you can lose them if you just grab them by the tail. Well, I'm pretty sure that's legal. This fly, man, it's working. Um, oh yeah, he's definitely over. Nice, man, I got a legal, sorry. Forgot I'm connected with you. All right, um, you have a... Uh, uh-huh, second red of the day. This one's legal. Okay. You don't want them right there because your line's gonna tangle all up in it. Here's that fly. Do you want to try a pink version or do you want to try exactly the same thing I'm using? Here you go. Sorry. Well, if it's working, all right? Mm -hmm. There's a red. I, I told you, you're right in front of us. There was a big one right here a while ago. Was there? Huge. Like, oversized, probably. I was trying to get them on, but he doesn't like my fly. Further see. out, I can see there's one. I can see there's something. I can't see, like, the size. Or yeah. Oh, are we, we going to go over there? Okay. Oh, this one's bigger. This fly is awesome. I love red fish. <laughs> I think he's legal. No, he's not bigger than the other one. I thought he was, he looked bigger. Yeah. The other one was long, he's a little thin, but. I don't think he's legal. What do you think? All right, keep them wet. See ya, man. Whoo! When I set the hook, I almost ripped the rod out of my hand. <laughs> So this fly is working, but it's been beat up. After a, a fight of a fish, you gotta kinda readjust it, I'm noticing, but it still works. It's lost some of its color, but that's okay. What? Uh, there's a couple of them right here. There's some dark spots. Three redfish, man. I am stoked. This is a uh, can die a happy man now. Yeah, especially a fly and the fly you made up. Yeah, I'm happy. If I can see them, I know how much to pull. I know when to, you know, look for the, look for the hit. You know what I mean? Yeah, no, I feel you. It sucks. And I, every one I've caught, I've I've seen the dark spot, 
and I've seen it moving and then change direction towards my fly. And I got to just imagine where their, my fly is, you know? Does that make sense? Nice. What is it? Good one? Yeah. On that redfish crack? Not illegal? Yeah, I'm coming. Yeah, I'll cast to it in a minute. There's a couple of them. I'm just coming to you first. Yeah. Oh, uh, yeah, I think he's short, dude. Hate yeah, to say he's it. like maybe 19 or 18. I was, yeah, I saw it too. Yeah, that's... Huh? Yeah, it's short, 18. Yeah. I got to rest, dude. Let's head back. Yeah. I think a burger, man, or something. I'm pretty hungry. And then maybe we, uh, we'll cast to them. Try to get some, but I think if we can head back, grab some food, rest for a little while, Maybe we can come back out, maybe not here, but go scout, you know, for some other type of fish. I mean, maybe reds, but like other areas, you know? I don't know, sorry, I'm just, I'm hurting. We got some gear tracks. A tog? Yeah, the mosquitoes are kicking up again. I think it was that diesel. You hear that diesel earlier? Yeah. Even if you make it to right here, it'd be awesome. Yeah. Let's see how they did it. I mean, this doesn't look like they went that deep, did it? Doesn't. And that truck seems kind of heavier. My truck can do this easy. Look at this. What is this? Is that a hog? Here, no. Small hog? Yeah. I can't really tell. There's four toes that kind of like this. Okay. That, that's a hog. Well, finally, I got a good trip down to the Gulf where I caught some fish. This new fly I created worked great. So stay tuned, guys, and I will make a video on how to tie them. Also, you can buy flies from me since I custom tie flies. So let me know what you want, and I will tie you up whatever it is you want to try. As you all know, I am sponsored by Risen Fly. I was actually the one who approached them for sponsorship because I love their gear so much. They're great prices on super high quality gear. So go to www.risenfly.com to check them out. Also type in McFly at checkout for 15% off of your first order with them. Check back next week for the final day's fishing at Corpus. We decided to go to the beach, but it was super busy because it was Sharkathon, which is kind of a fishing tournament. But we tried it anyway, and we're able to hook a few fish. If you could do me a favor and hit that like button. Also, subscribe if you haven't already. And check out my new Patreon page, where you can get early access to my videos and shoutouts on my channel. Go to www.patreon.com forward slash McFly to sign up today. Oh yeah! Woo! I will see you guys on the next video. Now you guys go catch some fish.